Welcome to a deep dive into the world of Plato, one of the most influential philosophers in history. Plato was born in Athens, Greece in 427 BCE and was a student of Socrates. He is best known for his theory of forms, which states that the material world is only a shadow or copy of the true reality, which can only be known through the mind and the senses. Plato's most famous work, The Republic, is a discussion of justice and the ideal state. In it, Plato argues that a just society is one where individuals are in the role that best suits their abilities, and that the rulers of society should be philosopher kings, who possess both knowledge and virtue. Plato also believed that knowledge and virtue were closely linked, and that in order to live a good life, one must strive for knowledge and wisdom. He believed that by understanding the true nature of reality, we could live a more virtuous and fulfilling life. But Plato's ideas were not limited to philosophy and politics. He also made significant contributions to mathematics, science, and psychology. He believed that mathematical concepts were also forms, and that by understanding math, we could gain a deeper understanding of reality. So how can Plato's ideas help us in our own lives? by understanding that the material world is only a shadow of the true reality. We can strive to gain knowledge and wisdom, and by understanding that virtue and knowledge are closely linked, we can work to become better, more virtuous people. By understanding Plato's ideas, we can live a more meaningful and fulfilling life. Another important aspect of Plato's philosophy is his belief in the immortality of the soul. He believed that the soul existed before birth and will continue to exist after death. He also believed that the soul was divided into three parts, reason, spirit, and desire. Each of these parts has its own function, and they must be in harmony for a person to live a virtuous life. One of Plato's lesser-known works, Phaedo, explores the idea of the immortality of the soul and the nature of death. In it, Plato argues that death is not an end but a separation of the soul from the body. He also argues that the soul is immortal and that it is the body that dies, not the soul. Plato also had a strong influence on education. He believed that education was essential for the development of the soul and that it should be based on the study of the forms. He established the Academy in Athens, which was one of the first institutions of higher learning in the Western world. The Academy was a place where philosophers, scientists, and mathematicians could come together to study and discuss ideas. It is also worth mentioning that Plato was deeply interested in the nature of poetry and literature, and his ideas on this subject have an important impact on the literary tradition. In his works, he criticizes the poets for their lack of knowledge of the truth and their tendency to appeal to the emotions rather than the reason. He believed that poetry and literature should be based on truth and knowledge, and that it should be used as a means of instruction and moral education. Finally, it's important to note that Plato's ideas have had a profound influence on Western philosophy, science, and culture. His theory of forms, his belief in the immortality of the soul, and his emphasis on virtue and knowledge continue to be studied and debated by philosophers and scholars today. His academy in Athens was the model for all later academies, and his ideas have been passed down through the ages, influencing countless thinkers and thinkers. This has been only the tip of the iceberg about Plato. We hope you liked our content, to help us keep releasing more content rapidly. Click on the subscribe button, we release a few videos each day to help you learn about philosophy. And living with virtue. Thanks for watching.